Okay, we well, on record now. Sure, no, I don't have no remote to turn it around, but I got a remote to pause it and zoom it and things of that nature. Don't most high tech shit. Uh. You want me to yell fish on every time I catch one? Yeah. No, it'll go for about an hour and a half without running the battery down. I can edit it, everything else. Cut the part that you ain't. When he catches just one and make him look like he caught about 10. Yeah. Take about 20 fishing trips to get 10 fish. Have to wear the same clothes, that way it makes it look like the same day. But. I didn't even see where that went. Damn. He did that so much as he hit the damn. Hell no, I won't have a chance. I think so. Here he is, he's a little bitty. Yeah. Well, these little bastards didn't get my bait. Oh yeah, I got him that door. Right that's how they've been biting them. Another damn pinfish. Yeah. There you go, brother-in-law. I guess I'm the baiter. The master baiter, huh? Yeah, and then when that battery runs dead, I got another camera over there. But it don't have no uh, wireless hookup. So y'all want to turn around and wave it to people on YouTube? <laughs> Oh, I got to introduce y'all. This is my son, Jeremy, my brother-in-law, Bruce. And I don't know what pier this is we're on. McPherson, Chester. Yeah, McPherson, Chester Pier. It's about two, three years old.
good. Maybe that was the last one I caught. Them damn little things. Do what? I don't know. No, you ain't supposed to, but. What's the worst that'll happen, huh? Yeah. Catch on fire. As long as I don't hold it up there, it would be okay. I just need a breather real quick. Oh, there he is. Oh, so they're going, everybody's going to know y'all as my son and brother-in-law. <laughs> yes, they ain't going to know y'all's real name. <laughs> I put it in subtitles, you know, in a little, yeah, you know, a little bubble, <laughs> speech bubble. Yeah. 
Well, we're going to tell everybody that you said it was the last weekend of August. I'll be there, Ken. You want to be there? <laughs> yeah, I'll be there. If I can get someone to cook some barbecue ribs and Tessie makes some coleslaw, I, I sure enough be there. I wear a cowbell too, too if I have to. No, I got it bought for me for my birthday, but I did, yeah. What did you get? Uh, Smith & Wesson 40. 40? Yeah, it's the F series. It's got the plastic can on the bottom of it. Uh, I got it in my Jeep. I'll show it to you. Yeah, the wife said they passed that law. It's legal now to carry. Anybody can carry one. After July 1st, it's an open carry law. It can't be concealed. Yeah. yeah. But you, it's still counts as the same thing as being carried in public. Yeah. 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 Y
I'll stay here and get me some oxygen. Smoke you know. Oh, I don't know. <clears throat> Like if you did a, like carrying it with you, I don't know. Oh, no, -uh, no, -uh. it's the same as your home. Since you your home, it can't be one in the chamber. It can be fully loaded, but it just can't be one in the chamber. But mine is in the chamber and fully yeah. loaded. That's why mine rides. Right. I'm like, there ain't no point. Go ahead and shoot somebody. What yeah. do you do? You gotta... Hold on, hold on one second. Yeah. All right, we're ready. <laughs> yeah, that's the way I am. Mine, <coughs> but I keep it locked in my glove compartment. And the only time I unlock, well, I unlock it when I'm riding. It's a habit I finally got into. Like, I'll unlock it when I'm going down the road just in case anything happens. And I'll lock it back when I get out. Because I'm so scared I'm going to forget to unlock it back, you know, and then someone's just going to rip it out of there. Yeah. I'm real careful. <clears throat> i got to take him to go get it clean. I'm going to go to Bird. That's just like his crack or something. He just, that's the number one thing. Anytime you need your gun clean, don't go buy that shit. Just bring it here. I'll do it. I'm like, all right. Saves me time and effort. Yeah, these white trout's hitting the top of the water out there right now. Our specs won. Yeah, they should be coming in pretty soon. It's flick as shit out here. I think I talked on this one. Do all these lights still work? I don't know. I oh, ain't been out here this year. I've been going to that Bluffton Bridge. Oh, yeah? Y'all been catching anything out there? Catch me. All right. Everywhere. Every place I stop. Catfish, catfish. Give me one of Caught a couple here, of croakers. Yeah. Other than that, ain't nothing. Why haven't you been out and around here? No. I see you drinking that headache beer, huh? Yeah, old skull crusher. Yeah, I have my share of that shit. <laughs> I'm tired of having headaches. Yeah, that's a hell of a hangover right yeah. there, bro. One of my, um, my boss actually told me the best thing to do is get you take two of Cedron, head extra strength right before you go to sleep, and you won't have a hangover when you wake up. The best thing to do when you gotta wake up, you grab your nose. Exactly, that's mine, <laughs> and that's what always gets me in trouble. <laughs> that's the way I used to do it. I hear one right beside the bed when I wake up, I drink it. Hair off the dog that bit you. That's the way Chris is now. Oh, yeah? Yeah, that's strong. Some bitch drink to take the beer a day. Yeah. That's what I said. I think it wasn't Thanksgiving we were all there next year.